Hello all, it is Henry NWR 1911 here. Here we are with a brand new series. Is a series that I oh, that wasn't supposed to happen. A series I like to call Henry NWR's reaction block. Oxer not not Henry's reaction blocks, Henry's reaction evenings. In this series, I will be, you know, just reacting to videos from a videos in the Thomas community, like some of my favorite Thomas videos. And today, we are going to be reacting to one of my best friends' YouTube channels, NeilFan18 Luke. He's, he's a really good friend on Twitter, and, you know, I haven't watched his videos much, but he seem, he I'm sure he makes pretty good videos. So we're going to be reacting to one of them. Let's do Train Room Tour Edition. Ooh, okay. I'm getting into focus. I don't know if you can see it. But, like, I, I love your display here. Your collection is clearly much more advanced than mine. You've got, like, uh, like, like Stepney, Emily, e, if my camera is not uh, fucking with me. We got Molly. We got the boxes. That's that's something I do in my display right now that I might show. I will be showcasing everything train related in my room. I have a couple of sections of my room that I dedicated to my trains, so I just thought, why not show it up? I pretty much dedicate my whole room to, like, my Thomas Wooden Railway layout. You're not alone, Luke. Without further ado, we shall get started. Now, I know everybody wants to see this, and it's a really nice section. But I'll just start off here first. Uh, these is, this is where I keep uh, my rolling stock. Yeah, I, I keep my rolling stock in a bin, much like that. Like that, you're, <laughs> you're not alone, bro. Oh, nice. You use Brio stuff in there, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, is that the power spotlight lorry back there? Looks like it. I see the new style Scruffy. How did I not notice that Can't before? Think of anything else new that I got. You still got a pretty decent collection. You got stuff I don't have, like the Blue Mountain Quarry car and the um, recycling cars. It's still pretty good. Then underneath it is my Thomas Wooden shirt. This one's for track, and this one's for destination. Oh yeah, I, I don't put my destinations on display. I just keep them full on on my layout. Because, like, I want to use each and every one of them. And over here, I got my dog set. It's cranky. And I have this just kind of as a backdrop. Even though it's a pillow. And then here is my uh, shelf. So, oh yeah, ooh. Have... Love that poster right there. Here, I'm going to try and get one for myself. <laughs> Elf. Yeah, I love that Magic Railroad promo of Thomas and James. Ooh, Canada, nice. I used to like cars when I was young. Oh, yeah, I see that. I I think Bachman could be a nice sub-collection for me. Then over here, I have uh, some of the new uh, TWR. Yeah, I'm, I, I think... A wooden Emily would be nice in my series, actually. Like, not the 2004 one, like the 2022 one. But, yeah. Uh, uh, ooh, we got, like, a faceless Brio duck right there. There are all the characters on display. This is what I'm interested in. Yeah, that's understandable. And well, sometimes you just want to collect stuff for your personal collection. Like, I put my two childhood Henrys, wooden Henrys that I had as a kid, on display because I'm going to build like a Henry shrine. Percy, I'm still debating on. 
Yeah, I mean, like, the Shocked Percy, that could be come in handy for, like, remakes, but, like, um, no one cares, really. I thought of just a couple of different ways to do that, so, yeah. Oh. Um. I see Derek right there. There's a wooden stuff in the hat. Yeah. Yeah, just everything else. Oh, Diesel 10. I also found a lady recently, uh, this winter, Drake, uh, Miami Activity, uh, so, yeah, and here's my Narrow Beach guys. Yeah, your narrow gauge collection is honestly, it's all the same. It's a little bit better than mine. You know, you have like Mike, like I only have Frank. Uh, CGI characters. I recently got Mike. Yeah, I honestly don't care about CGI characters right now. I tend to just stick on model characters. But I really respect how you try to like focus on characters that got neglected in the show. I I I can respect that. <laughs> okay, that was my horrible impression of Smudger's laugh. <laughs> F. <laughs> but, yeah. Uh. I, I, I watched this. Ooh, let's see your Ertl collection. Ooh, your Ertls. Yeah. Ooh. Um, yeah, really nice collection there. That's actually a really good deal. Big W there, Luke. So yeah, this stuff is uh, pretty minimum. I have a lot of junk. <laughs> it's not minimum. I mean, it's better than any display I could have made. You know, you should see my closet display. I'm not showing it because it is disgraceful at the moment. This shelf, uh, so I don't really have this shelf. Only has like the Thomas stuff, and then I guess down here there's a capsule player. I have some other things, like I like The Simpsons. Um, Me too, I love The Simpsons. I like the four, first four seasons on DVD. Creator, Cookie Monster, uh, some hockey memorabilia, as hockey is my favorite sport. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty That's a pretty good display there, Luke. Let's, let's, let's look at another video. Oh, he's made, ooh, Train Spotting, Christmas on Sodor. Oh my god, those, when did this come out? Ooh, December 11th. Oh my god, those those shots there, Luke, that looks gorgeous. Like, the realistic snow, I can't tell if that's real snow or not, it probably is. And the beautiful evening sky, oh my god. Uh, it's, at the moment I'm recording this, it's like 11.50pm, and it's raining outside. I, this is, this is gorgeous. Oh, the, oh there's Bertram. Oh, let me go back. Oh, there's, is that Bertram? Yeah, I think that's Bertram, the 2001 where he's portrayed as a tank engine. Oh, Duncan. Duncan, oh my god. That's just so calming and... Calming. I couldn't tell who that was. I think that was Millie. Oh, oh god, that looks beautiful. Edward, that looks like, that looks like Edward. Or... Derek, I think, or both. Derek, my my, how's Duncan again? Oh God, that looks that looks beautiful. If it it didn't snow at all this win past winter for me, but if it does, I am going to do a video like that. Oh my God, God, oh God, oh one of the locking logos. Oh Freddie, Freddie. You know, even though I wish I was, like, born in 97, I've said this before, so I could more properly experience Thomas when it was good, instead of just looking at the content when it's, like, old. Old, you know? Oh, I still Ill am glad I was born in 2006 and started my channel now, so I could meet, eat great people like Luke. Luke, but, yeah. <laughs> okay. Ooh, Fred. Yeah, I knew that was Freddy right there. Ooh. This is dark. Yeah, Bertram pulling him away. Oh, damn. You actually got damaged Freddy for that. That's cool. So, to make a long story short, all 
Neofan18 is one of my best friends in this fandom. He only has like 300 subscribers, but in my opinion, he deserves way more. Everyone, go subscribe to Neofan18 now. He is one of my best friends in the community, and he makes really good quality content. content. And also, subscribe to me, you know? It's not a competition in the end for subscribers. We all make good content in our own way, and he is no different than us. Also, that layout on the banner there looks awesome. I love I love the detail of Butch sitting there in the background. I love the engine wash being right next to Tidmouth Sheds right there. Eric, just, your layout looks pretty good. You know, my layout, it stretches around and, like, around my bed. So, like, naturally, a, a lot of the time, the sets look dark. But you have much better lighting than me, Neil. So, congrats on that. Everyone, go subscribe to NeilFan18. And thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.